Hi there ladies and gentlemen, this is the Bearded Gamer and today we'll be playing the game Wooden House as part of the series is it really that bad? So I do not even remember what this game is. I downloaded it a while ago. Apparently it's some first person horror game and it's mostly negative reviews on Steam. So let's let's give it a shot. See what it's all about. It's actually the first non-free negatively rated game that I've I'm playing so let's see what it's all about I get out to the fresh air to hell all the city bustle the time to enjoy the peace and silencing sitting by the fireplace in the new house uh -huh. Ooh, okay okay let's how there is cold and gloomily what that's not even English Okay, okay So to start off, let me just point out it looks all right. The graphics are okay. Okay These fuel cans can maybe come in handy. Wow. They, they really should have used Okay, it should be in the basement. Why should it be in the basement? How do you know this? See it's it's details like this that make these games uh, get rated badly I mean, first of all, make a good translation. If this is, if this was done in another, it, it should be in the, again. So if, if it was from another language and it was just translated, the translation is bad. Hello and welcome. Now the house is in your hand. Thank you for buying of this wonderful house. Before entering the house, make sure that the heating turned on. Oh my god. The key to the main entrance you can find in the basement in the basket. The fuel cans are behind the house. Have a nice holiday. Real estate agency of the <laughs> This is this is bad English. You can find in the basement in a basket. The fuel cans. Hey. Okay. The basement. Oh. Hey. House of Terror. Perfect. And this is like a skull with horns. Fantastic. At this point, I would be like, hey. Hey, real estate of this house person. What the hell? Okay, I see tools. I see a picture of a... That's probably the guy who made the... I don't know. So why would the... Um, I need to bring the fuel to turn the gender. Who this English is giving me an aneurysm or something? Oh, do we do we pull it? I heard something. Where's the key? Wait, it said. It said that the keys are in the basement. <laughs> Okay, so we picked up the barrel and we put it in our pocket, I guess. <laughs> why, people who create games like this? Why? You you created... Mm -hmm. Good. Good. There's random sounds. Okay. Start it again. That's that's step number one. And there's oh uh, uh, what? When did we? When did we pick up the key? I am here in the new house. The price was very low, but the house is really wonderful. I switched on the heating, and now I have to turn on the generator for the light. But in the basement is very dark. I found a red candle that go down there. Until the last part of that sentence. It was looking... Wait, what? The house that is heating bones... Save games. Save game, yes. Oh my god, even I'm forgetting my English right now. Okay, so that's a save game checkpoint thing. And, okay. I... I already did that! Why is there a sound? Oh, but with nobody. <laughs> I love this. Okay. 
Um, Okie dokie. So we need to go to the basement again. Stop it! Cockroaches everywhere. I need to find the candle that highlight the way down. Okay, let's do that. There's a lamp. I see no can. Is this a candle? This is a candle. Okay, so you click it again to pick it up. Does it automatically pull it out? The candle. Yeah. Oh. Oh, and now things are getting interesting with random noises and stuff. Oh, that's the candle. I do not. I do not want to go there. There is too dark. These are confounded generators. How long can I repair them? I hate this basement. I found the battery in one of the small rooms in the basement. I turn on the switch with its help. Oh my god, this English. I can't get over it. Sorry. Oh, we turned that on. It wasn't the candle. Okay. Okay. But this is a massive basement. Oh my god. I need the battery to turn on the switch. Um, mm -hmm. what is the attack? There are always something wrong in the basement and this door. I have not found the keys to this house for 10 years or is very old. And last time I saw a rat the size of a dog. I do not know what is there, but the sounds are heard. Not a pleasant. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Oh, that's, that's just perfect. Look at that. <laughs> oh, the, it's not a door, it's teeth that you need to somehow... But where's the battery for this thing? It's turning! But it's not turning on. So there's a door... <laughs> this is amazing! This, this could turn out to be horrifying, if not for the English and the bugs. Is the battery here? Here it is. How did I not see it before? Okay. Let's go back. This is a car battery. Are we really going to be using a car battery to power the whole house? Because that's low. Oh, it automatically. Okay. Well, I have finished my work. I switched on the heating and now I can relax. Perhaps I read a book in my leisure or drink something. I need to look it up to see if this was actually written in English or in some other alien language and the translation just went all wrong. Oh, oh, it is time of peace and silence. Maybe I can find the keys, maybe not. Let us take a screenshot. Okay, now there's light. I like this. There's the old book. It wasn't here before. Right, you are non-english person who translate really badly oh Ooh, what's going on i hear i am too tired i need okay stop let's close the door so we don't lose any heat i need a key of course you do just kick it in man Aye, was that ours? Our sounds? Oh! Keys! I think I should go to the kitchen and drink or eat something. Is this kitchen? This is a pretty cool house. If it wasn't so freaky. Okay. Yes, press F. Oh, we're gonna get wasted now. Things are gonna start happening. Hey, take it easy! <laughs> That's rude. No. There's the bedroom upstairs. I'm tired and I want to sleep. Hey, stop. Stop interacting. Nightmares? One dream every night. Next to the bedroom, there is an open door. And when I just go through this door, there is a stiff. I feel st anyway. This dream's so real that it's difficult to distinguish. The voices are called me. They shout. I have a feeling that what they did it, it was definitely written in another language. 
And what they did was put all the text. Oh, who is this? They probably just put all the text in Google Translate and just copy pasted everything there. What was that? Oh, it's the save. Sure, let's save. Yes. Sure. Did the chess pieces move? Or did they completely disappear? That's the watch that's making the sound, I guess. Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> Fucking hell. The sound is so... <sighs> oh, nice fireplace. Not nice, but probably really good. I do not need the old documents. Understood. You know, you could... This house could be really cool with some proper taking care of. Freaking key. Just kick it down. Okay, let's go upstairs. Where the freaky shit happens in games, usually. This does not turn on. Uh -huh. I wanna... Finally, I found it after all this time. The doors are opened at night. I thought that I dreamed the nightmare again. There is a decent... To deep house behind the door. A descent to the part deep house. Yes. There's something like a room for doing the rituals, but when I opened it, dead peoples tried to kill me as long as I liquidate the book. I need to put it to its place. The most important thing it is getting to basement descent. Decent. As in well dressed decent. Or when you're going down. Descent. I. Ah, uh, so we came all the way here, and we don't have the freaking key. Come on. This is the part where I I start to question the game, as in, is it me that's missing something, or is the game making a little too too difficult and not obvious? Not obvious. I don't want it to be obvious. Where's the fun in that? But. This looks like there's no clues as to where to find the key you need to move on. We don't need the documents. There's nothing here. Oh! Why would it be... You see? Why was it there? How does it make sense that it's there? Why would we go through all that just to randomly find it because... Anyway, anyway, we found it. Let's go to the bedroom. Because I'm sure nothing weird is going to happen here. Door locked. Door locked. What is this place? It's m massive. Jesus. Okay. Oh, now we can open drawers. Just, just the one, though. Okay. Ah, oh, there's a book here. Let's read it. Oh, I was waking up the noise. Noise. From the next door. I need to check is there everything okay. Oh my god. Do they, do they even read this stuff? Proofread it? Obviously not. Before releasing it on Steam. How? Why? <laughs> I, I just don't get it. Blood and dream. What? Oh, yeah. Interesting shit's gonna happen, guys. Let's save. Do, 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 do. You see, even though it's so badly... This game is so badly... What's the word? Programmed, I guess. <clears throat> it still manages to be a little bit... Oh! oh, my God. That just escalated really quickly. Is he still coming? Let's go downstairs. Yeah, he's still... No. What the hell just happened? This person was like a stiff whole punk and I didn't get to read what it said. Ah, uh, okay. We came downstairs and now what? Oh! This monster did not let me go. I must find another entrance. Ah, oh, shit. I'm not even going to say it. But the monster's not even coming, though. Perhaps a ingenious idea. 
I, from from what I've read, all ho all horror movies and horror games end up well when you go to the basement to hide from ghouls or monsters. Or oh! <laughs> oh, let's go, let's go. Things just got super. Yes, let's save the game. Okay. You see, this is such a badly written game. But <laughs> oh my god! I I don't even. It could have been freakier if if that monster was still chasing us. But you know. Oh, what is this? Oh, what just happened? It was a real nightmare. I have found the skeleton of the previous owner of this house. He could not destroy the book, but I have finished his work. I hope that I can get out of this place. The most important thing is to find the entrance. Full stop. Ugh. Oh! The game crashed. It's okay, guys. No, don't panic. We just saved the game. It's cool. Did it really crash? Yep. Alright guys, so long story short, the game crashed and then my audio recording program crashed and everything went nuts. Uh, it didn't crash, it just stopped recording. I have no idea how that happened. I think when the game crashed, I probably clicked on something. And let me just tell you guys and review what happened i tried to load this was it yeah this was the save game i was trying to load so when i loaded that up immediately i would die respawn in the bedroom and be stuck in the floor not being able to move so i had to load the bedroom save game immediately to continue from there this time oh okay so we're loading from the bedroom okay this is the exact same place that it crashed before Come on, this is so bad. Uh, don't you want to put a good game out there so people can get a good idea of who you are? Because, oh, this is what was happening before. See, I died and now I'm stuck. I can't move. And now I can't use the, I can't use the menu. Okay, so I've, I've successfully replicated the problems I was having before if, as if that's a good thing. Anyway. Okay, wish me luck. Let's hope it doesn't crash. Let's hope it doesn't crash. Come on. Oh, it didn't crash. It's a modern day miracle. They still haunt me. I should find the entrance. We have the save game. I'm not going to touch it. I'm not even sure if there's a way to open that. If there's a secret or something, but whatever. Maybe I can get through here. Yes. Pull that thing and get through it. Oh, Jesus, he's fast. Brains. Oh, my Lord. Now he's slower. Because <laughs> we need to pull this. See? I've become an expert at this game. Sad as that may sound. What is he even? Okay, now. Now we're in the safe, if that's even proper English. See, I'm, I'm getting, I'm forgetting my English from this game. So, this puzzle, I wasted a lot of time when I was play, recording before. Now I know what to do. It makes no sense. I just randomly figured it out. So you need to connect the wires in using H J K keys. So, H J K H J K. The thing is, there's no indication that I know of. That you need that you can you know figure out using logic which goes where so I've discovered that J goes with K before by the way when I was pressing K it would teleport me back here every every single time I press K I don't know why so K goes with H and H goes with J and that's it I have never been so happy to the Sun and fresh air because English, yes. 
I got out of this place, I left the book in the basement, deeds, deads were chasing me even after I left the book on the altar, unfortunately the writer of this book could not get out, Ash T, dead, he tried to give the book back, apparently, again, I did not read what it says, the book cannot be destroyed but it can be locked for a few hundred years. How much evil would not be in the world, there is always a drop of light in the darkness, the book's owner gradually became dead and he felt how lost himself, makes no sense. The darkness corrupts people, nobody could not give you back your soul and mind, you need to remember this. Even if there's a deep, you know, message that the, the person who made this game was trying to give out, with this English, it's just not registering, you know? So just a few words about the game it's it's a it's a short game literally around less than half an hour and uh it's 2.99 on steam and it has so many bugs there's only there's literally like two parts where it's scary where that thing is chasing you but that's it so you're in a weird house and there's a weird thing in it and there's noises and it chases you and you get out by connecting randomly some wires for absolutely no reason so what I was just trying to point out is that you're going to release a game on Steam and sell it to people. At least make sure that, you know, it's it's a small game. Make sure that there's no bugs. What did it crash again? So make sure that there's no bugs. I mean, it's not a massive game. You need to check everything. Just make sure that those less than 30 minutes of gameplay are working properly. And if the wire part at the end how, why was i supposed to connect the wires randomly like that i mean was there a book somewhere that i missed if if so my bad so anyway so the verdict is it really that bad because of all the bugs and the crashes and the weird save game issues and all that yeah it really is that bad up to before the crash i was literally thinking you know what i'm gonna give this game a positive review on steam because why not it, it had its scary moments it's cheap it's short the graphics are okay but after all all the adventures i had to go through to actually finish the game no it's really that bad so i i won't be giving a positive review that's just my two cents so anyway that's going to be it for now guys so thank you all for watching this is the bearded gamer over and out